welcome to Robco Industries, time link, uh, do, 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 do. security instructions, confidential, belt 101 is designed to test the long term effects of suspended animation on unaware human subjects, security staff are responsible for maintaining installation integrity and monitoring science staff activity. In no circumstance are staff allowed to deviate from assigned duties. Insubordination or interference with vault operations are kept to a vent. Security staff are authorized to use lethal force. Upon activation notice from Vault Tech, all personnel are required to report to the entry area and assist with admittance of Vault Resident security personnel. Maintain order and ensure that no personal or residents attempt to evacuate the vault. Research staff will be responsible for resident intake and escort each other to designated cryogenic pod. Uh, residents not accounted for in the manifest should be allowed to step aside and detained forcefully by security if necessary. Once all residents have been sealed into preservation chambers, dispose of any detainees. Revolt entry must remain sealed under any circumstances. Stay on until the vital signs of Kleinerjack preserved residence. Okay, so something happened because they were meant to check for intrusion. Okay. All clear and evacuation. All clear message. Following nuclear event, Vault Tech will monitor hazards such as radiant shouldn't levels enemy invasion subsequent subsequent attacks and other effects deaths once conditions are deemed safe this terminal will receive an all clear notice upon arriving the all clear notice vote tech personnel maybe over see your discretion Disregard any notices from organizations or individuals not associated from Voltec, including government and military. Residents are not to be dis disrupted or evacuated. Voltec will not will attend to their needs remotely once Volt 1 1 staff has been evacuated. Short term assignment, non residential personnel expected to carry out research. Okay. All right. Oh, okay, never mind. Um, security logs. God, it finally happened. The world's over. Barely got all the residents inside. Now everyone made it. Now it's just us and the icebergs. I don't get it. Eggheads try to explain to me that keeping them frozen is a big experiment for a better future or something. I don't know. It just doesn't seem right that we're smiling at them all that time before putting them in on ice. Shouldn't we have told them something? No, because then that probably would have disrupted the experiment, which means I caused it because I knew what was going to happen. Christmas Underground got together the rest of the security boys and support staff, and we had a little party. Best gift that got handed out was a fancy lad snack cake that wasn't too stale. No sweet rolls. God. None of the scientists came. Overseer wasn't there either. I just don't get them. They're hiding something from us. Another company secret for only for the higher-ups. Whatever. 
Just a few more months until the all clear is supposed to come through. Then we can start rebuilding. But it never did. So what's happened out there? Only a few weeks left in the mandatory shelter period. Everyone's getting stir crit. Hang on. Isn't there a problem with this? If the only people that aren't in the vaults if the only people that survived went in the vaults, right? And no one's allowed to leave the vaults until you get the all clear. Oh no, it's not to rebuild, is it? It's just like when it's safe to come out. Okay, never mind. Some people are saying the all clear signal is never going to come. We can't just stay here. We can't stay here much longer, that's for sure. It's not just the fact that I've been staring at the same break room and bunk bed for the over six months. It's the fact that we only have enough food left for another few months tops. You ever see it keeps telling everyone to be patient, focus on work, he's definitely keeping us on the loop. Something bad's going on, I just know it. Right. Two things that might have happened. Overseer has killed everyone, or killed the guards at least, and then either evacuated or got people to go in and kill the others, like my wife, or um, they ran out of food and died. Either way, security are probably dead. Because otherwise they'd be looking for intruders. The main door accessing the vault exit is malfunctioning. Now the only way out is for the OFC is an evacuation tunnel. How convenient for him. He has one of his clients team watching the door into his office at all times from a little makeshift checkpoint. Got invited to a meeting tonight. Support the staff as in security only. Sounds like I'm not the only one with an axe to grind. In the last entry. No all clear from Voltec is coming, we need to leave. We're all out of food. I almost murdered Stanley for dropping a goddamn salt cracker on the floor. A handful of us confronted the OFC about opening up the vault. I never knew a man that small could shout that loud. Now he's locked himself in his office along with the rest of the science staff. We're supposed to hand over any food, weapons, or medicine we have by tonight, or there's going to be consequences. I've talked to everyone, it's time. One way or another, we're getting out of this vault. But they never did. <laughs> Actually, probably never did. Anyway, load hollow tape. Hang on. You have no. Oh, okay. So floppy disks we can get and put them in. Okay. As a rather rich. Giant roaches? What the hell? Rob Killam Mysteries, I see a memo. Tim, what? What? Play tape. Oh, okay. So those were high scores. Oh, it's King Kong. What's that do actually? What's that? 
Uh, power. I'm a dick. Okay, fuck it. Okay, that kills us. Okay, that just makes us invincible. Come on, change. Gonna change? Okay, fine. Oh shit. Should have predicted that. Oh dear. Alright, you know, wait for red. Wait for it to go right and then we'll go up. There we go. Oh shit. And then wait for it to go left. Oh no, you can't, can you? Wait, what? It's time limit? Oh. Right, hang on. Exit that. Yes. What's the top 10? Oh, sod it. It can be arsed. Um, let's have a look around. Actually, let's take that with us. Right then. Um, how do we get out through the bedrooms? Nope. Uh, okay, nothing in here. Oh, okay, through here. Oh. Oh shit. Really? <laughs> I've got a hit already, god damn it. Ooh. What happened here? Where is everyone? Left O. Okay. Oh, hang on. Does drinking water give us anything? No. Okay. Oh, this is the overseer's office. Okay. So, let's have a look at this terminal. Um, okay. No, not that. I've dreamed long of making cryogenic freezing available in a poor table on demand form. The cry later, later is my last attempt. Thankfully, we're in no short supply of the chemicals and components I need to tinker with the prototype. It's a nice way to occupy the time as we wait for the all clear signal. Oh, this is a thing. Let's see his log. Operations. 
Final staff orientation is complete. All but a few of the residents down in Sanctuary Hills have been enrolled. And several from the Concord as well. Vault Tech supervisors came up this week to do a technical review with me. This vault is ready to open. I can only imagine what wonders our residents will get to witness. A notion of leaping forward in time. I almost wish I could join them and see promise the promise of our future realised. Oh hang on, that's the wrong one. Strange issue today with pod C3. Subject appear to be having heart palpitations. What pod were we? Nothing life threatening, but unusual. We realised almost too late that the pod was malfunctioning. Cryogenic array almost started thawing her out. We're not sure, but I suspect a hiccup in Vault Tech's remote override systems may have sent an errant signal. We'll have to keep an eye out, but I only hope that the systems are reliable once we evacuate the staff. Okay, so we're going to go back and see what pod C3 is. If it's our wife, if it's who, whatever. Whoever. It's been no all clear signal yet, even though we're nearing the end of the 180 mandatory sheltered period. Supplies were never intended to last much more than that. Despite my best efforts, people are beginning to question what we're doing down here. People think we can just leave them when the 180 days are up. They're insane. A radioactive exposure would still be a pot potent enough to fry everyone if the vault seals a breach that early. Our point of the all clear was to receive additional instructions from the main office. I don't know what to do. I can't open the vault. I can't expect our supplies to last forever. I just... Blank. A faction led by security personnel have turned on me. Demanding they will be allowed to leave the vault. Idiots. I will not open the door to be irradiated to death out there. I'm consolidating the remaining supplies, putting the staff on lockdown. We're going to have to start prioritizing who deserves what little food we have left. I've been too generous with the rations. People don't like it. Well, that's fewer mouths to feed. Okay, so he did turn out to be a twat. We will open the tunnel in a moment. For now, I just want to check that there's nothing important here. Oh, there we go. There's a pistol. We still don't know how to change inventory. Wait, hang on. Settings, controls. Toggle pit boy, mouse free. No, that's not mouse free. Hang on. Right, settings, controls. Is there anything on tab? Because I want it on tab. Oh, what's on tab? Pitboy. Oh, Pitboy is on tab. Okay, we haven't got a Pitboy yet, though. Nice. Coming back later for you. Okay. So, once we're a master at lock picking, we can come and. Get everyone out of here. And we're encumbered. Great. Bloody fantastic. What can we dump in here? Okay. Store. Okay, can we move now? Nope. No. Wait, why am I moving slowly? Because by the look of that, I've got enough. Yeah, I've got enough there. Okay. Terminal somewhere. Oh, right, yeah. Okay. Why am I walking so bloody slow? Okay, right. So let's go to. Oh. Okay. Oversee's tunnel. 
Terminal weaving. Terminal. Open evacuation tunnel. It's personal. The personal activation tunnel is now open. Remind all staff to be orderly and follow the shutdown protocols for exiting and receiving Vault 1 1. Please maintain all staff records and research. Report to your local Vault Tech superiors for debriefing and further instruction. Oh, shit. Oh, bugger. Stop it. Okay. Um oh shit. Oh, there we go. Pet boy. Special perks, none, inventory, appeal, aid. Okay. No radios yet, okay. Okay, and now we go. And here we go. Going back up to the surface. Change per nope. That's all good. Enjoy your return to the surface and thank you for choosing Vault Tech. And there we go. Oh, so we've got the good old Skyrim player mo well model. We can do it. Like, not on. 
No. And here we go. The surface. So now we won't put any music on because we've got this music. But if it does get. Actually, I don't even know if I can put on music. I don't know if it'll break copyright if I do. I probably shouldn't put on music. Also, why am I walking so slow? Yeah, I know that. Why am I walking like really? S Is there a walk button? I've accidentally pressed. Toggle always run. Okay. No. I never put it on. Oh, there we go. Aha. Uh -huh. Right then. What happened? What happened to the world? Uh, well, sir. Well, besides our geranium still being the envy of Sanctuary Hills, I am afraid things have been dreadfully dull around here. Things will be so much more exciting with you and Mrs. Back. Oh. Where is your back? They... They killed her. Sir, these things you're saying... These I like how it looks shocked. I believe you need a distraction. Yes, a distraction to calm this dire mood. Well, it's if you're offering to... We had a proper family activity. Checkers, or perhaps charades. Sean does so love that game. <laughs> uh, keep putting your foot in it, Codsworth. <laughs> Oh yeah, shit. He's not. Codsworth, listen to me carefully. Have you seen him? Have you seen Sean? Why, the, the missus had him last, remember? Or oh, perhaps she's gone to the Parker residence to arrange a play date. I'm sure she'll be back with him momentarily. I told you she's dead, you idiot. It doesn't make sense. There's just no reason someone would take my son. It's worse than I thought. Mm. You're suffering from hunger-induced paranoia. <laughs> Not eating properly for 200 years will do that, I'm afraid. <laughs> <laughs> 200 years? What? Are you? A, a bit over 210, actually, sir. Or oh, give and take a little. For the Earth's rotation and some minor dings to the old chronometer. <laughs> That means you're uh, two centuries late for dinner. Ha <laughs> ha uh, Gotta love the robots in this game. Codsworth, you're acting a little bit weird. What's wrong? I... I... Oh, sir, it's been just horrible. 
two centuries with no one to talk to, no one to serve? I spent the first ten years trying to keep the floors waxed. <laughs> <laughs> the way you can just switch it off. Have you seen anything dangerous? Oh, just the usual, sir. Bombs.